The General Directorate of Passports confirmed that the penalty for those who caught performing Hajj without a permit will be deportation from the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, and they will be banned from re-entering into the country for 10 years. Anyone who is caught going to Mecca or the holy sites for Hajj without a permit will be fingerprinted and turned back. Their services in the passport department will be suspended. When they will come for any passport service, they will be arrested and deported. Saudi nationals who caught transporting illegal pilgrims to the Hajj sites will be fined by 10,000 riyals for each pilgrim, in addition to 15 days in prison for the first time. In case of expatriates, they also face the same punishment, including deportation. In case of repeating the violation, the fine will be increased up to 50,000 riyals for each illegal pilgrim, a prison term for six months, and seizure of the vehicle. The Ministry of Hajj and Umrah had confirmed that Hajj rituals for this year could only be performed by those who hold a Hajj visa or reside in the kingdom, including Saudi citizens and resident expatriates with an iqama. One of the main conditions for citizens and resident expats to perform Hajj pilgrimage this year is they must have received three doses of vaccine against coronavirus with immune status in their tawakkal application. This year, Saudi Arabia has allowed 1 million pilgrims to perform Hajj. 850,000 of them are international pilgrims and 150,000 are the local pilgrims. The procedure for applying for Hajj pilgrimage from inside of the kingdom is announced through the Ministry of Hajj website.